Hi, I'm Peter Kelmstrom of Kelmstrom.com Business Solutions. In this demonstration, I'll continue tweaking and improving the house loan calculation example that we have been looking at in the previous demonstrations. As you see now, I have a bunch of data here, and uh, now you can really start playing around with the data and see that the interest is kind of high here. It's $500 a month. So if I try to borrow a bit less, maybe just 70%, that does make a difference in the total and of course in the interest part of it too. For your own calculations you want to expand this example quite a bit but that's one of the main points here that you can start playing around. So if you get an insurance of just 45, what does that make on the totals? You can play around and change all these input values and you can see all the data changing. So illustrating and playing around with data, that's where Excel really really shines. And in terms of illustrating, of course we are going to go into charts a lot more in future demonstrations but I just want to show you a quick one here. here I'm just going to select the main monthly costs of this uh, and as you see I get a little this little quick analysis thing. I can just click that and then I get formatting, I get charts and I, of course I do want a chart. And here I can just click a pie chart and there I have a pie uh, chart and uh, I can play around with that. I can mouse over and see that this is in fact the interest and I can play around with all these different ready-made formats of this. This was actually a rather beautiful one. Let's have that one in there. That looks cool, right? So now if I change the loan value to just 40%, you'll notice that this changes right away. So short title there, double click, monthly house costs. That makes it all very, very visible. What am I spending my money on for this house? And what I did again, as a repetition, I just selected, went into the, this quick analysis tool, and selected the illustration of the information that I wanted, and in this case, just a pie chart. Click that, and there I can have my, my pie chart. Very nice, quick illustration of all the work that we did in the previous demonstrations. Thank you for watching this one.